Teresa. I am 60 and fabulous. Traveling in Mexico, enjoying my best life here. In today's video, we are gonna spend time on the beach surfing. Early morning, six o'clock, and I am ready to go for surfing lessons with Richard. He is my surfing coach. I met him at the um, Sunset Meditation Group, and I've decided to improve my surfing skills. So today, we are going to catch the best waves at Punta Mita, a well-known place between local people only, and it's about ten minutes. Uh, motorbike right um, from my place where I live right now at La Cruz so um, Richard is gonna come any minute to pick me up and off we go come along on the ride with me friends and let's have fun here he comes hola Richard hola buenos dias buenos dias <laughs> como estas Oh, muy bien, muy bien, gracias. ¿Cómo es tu mañana? <laughs> muy, muy buena. Estoy lista. Vamos. So today I am surfing at Banderas Bay and the beach calls La Lancha. Richard is here. We are ready. Wow. So we are just about to start our lessons and uh, Richard is holding uh, the punch. So what are you going to do with that, Richard? Um, conch shells are always gifts, and so they're used to clear the energy and clear our space. So it makes a really loud noise and uh, a big bellow, and it's kind of like playing the trombone. And I'm gonna blow it to clear the energy before our soap session. Awesome. Richard is going to teach me how to read the waves. So what that means to we have to read the waves? Well, it's, um, it's really about taking the patience and the time. So before I go rushing out surfing, I always spend 10 minutes sitting down connecting with the ocean, connecting with the sand, and this allows me the time and the space to see what's going on out in the ocean, like right now. But taking a moment or two to really watch and read the waves to see where they're coming in, to see where they're breaking, See what kind of intervals we've got between the sets, what our winds are doing, what the people are doing, where the people are sitting in the waves. Not like that. There's a lot of different things to assess and each day is different. Now that we're all warmed up, we're stretched out, we're safe, we went over the waves, we talked about uh, any potential currents or how everything's happening today, where the tides are at, let's go surfing. 
Hey guys, just checking in, uh, waiting for Larissa to catch some waves out here. Just noticing how great she's doing. She's really patient with her pop-up. Um, she's allowing lots of time to really get into that wave, to drop into it, to get comfortable. She's not rushing to her feet. Um, she's not over paddling. She's not looking down at her feet. She's not doing a lot of the things that a lot of people do generally. So I'm super proud of her and she's about to roll in another wave. That was so good, homie! So after only a couple of days of surfing with uh, Richard, I feel really confident. He's absolutely awesome coach. And if you come to be Puerto Vallarta for visiting or you live here and you want to surf like a pro, Richard is your guy, hands down. Information I'm going to leave in the comments below and you can contact him whenever you want. I hope you enjoyed surfing with me today, friends. And if you did, please don't forget to press the like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see more upcoming videos about different aspects of life in Mexico. Thank you for watching, everyone, and ciao, ciao for now.